Hello, everyone. Good evening. Welcome. Good evening, teacher. How are you today, Carlos Ernesto? We miss you. I so so uh, the the last week it was complicated. Okay, okay, because of your work. What? Uh, for your work. Yeah. Oh, for okay. Work. Okay. Well. Uh, it to uh, for her to uh, how do you say se descompuso <laughs> the uh, car oh okay um the se dice the car broke broke the car down broke, mm -hmm. ah, broke okay. down the car broke down I, me sucedió ay ay el qué le sucedió a ver cuénteme <laughs> <laughs> o sea eh, ajá eh, the clutch, it was ah okay. it was uh, it was uh, the clutch uh, the broke broke down uh, ah, okay. cable oh okay it was the Friday and more or less six seven p.m. Oh my goodness! <laughs> yeah, I can imagine. Yeah. Uh, it was complicated in the traffic. In the traffic. Oh, God. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. I, I can't tell. I can't tell. I've seen that before. Yeah. Well, I'm so sorry, Carlos Ernesto. <laughs> but uh, but please, you should know that uh, we missed you. Yeah, we missed you. And we are happy that you are back. Okay. We are happy that you are back. <laughs> okay. Well. Uh, did you watch the videos? Uh, a little bit. A little, okay, yeah. A little bit. All right, all right. Well, today we are going to do a uh, short feedback, so you were going to catch up just a little bit too. Okay, mm -hmm, okay. don't worry. Um, only uh, I was probably in the task 1.5. Number, oh, in homework. Mm -hmm. In homework, uh, only uh, point four, point five. Ah, uh, because of the um, use oh, of would uh, rather, right? Would rather order, order the sentences. Order the sentences. Okay, using would rather. If I'm not wrong, mm -hmm. would rather, would prefer, and also mm -hmm, allow me third, to remember. Second mm -hmm. and third. Ooh. Oh, okay. I, I don't know. Four in five. Okay. We're going to see it. Uh, I know. I know the order. Mm -hmm. But I don't know the uh, platform. The uh, platform, yeah? Platform. No, rec uh, no, la no, 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 I don't know. Oh, okay. Uh, it's well. Mm -hmm. Actually, you should just uh write the subject. I will share. I will share this with you. Okay, I will share. La cosa es que como ya lo tengo hecho, I have it already sold. It's going to show all the answers. All right, so it doesn't matter. You're going to uh try to think about it later. Right, but right now you can check the answers. Mm. Okay, here they are. Look, and number one, it says the creative team, and then would rather ask to design the manager a relaunch of the product. So the manager will be uh, the, mm -hmm, the subject. The, the, the number one is good. Two ah, okay. Uh -huh. Equal. Okay. Three equal. All right. Number four. Mm -hmm. I don't know. He, yes, my company. Mm -hmm. say, Many here, companies would here, rather here right now. operate yeah. as a premium option. Many companies uh -huh. would, would rather operate as a uh -huh. premium option. As a premium option. 
uh, once the product is in the decline stage. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And number five, mm -hmm. uh, many more companies mm -hmm. would rather become the low cost provider of a product with great caution about price wars. Okay, here you've got to be careful with the spelling because it has a dash right between the two words. Remember, low dash cost. Maybe that's your the thing you are missing. Um, mm -hmm. Maybe. Uh, mm -hmm. I review mm -hmm. my, my answers. Mm -hmm. okay. The low cost, and then it says, hey, actually, yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't need include the complete with great caution right about war prices maybe that's not part of it okay become mm -hmm. the low cost provider of yeah mm -hmm. a product with a ah uh, here it is look it uh, says ah uh, uh-huh this is uh, uh, let's say it's a mistake because caution is not countable, right? But it has to be there because of the, thank you very much, because of the platform, they uh, configured it like that. Okay. Remember, with a great caution. Uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah, because in like, the, in the original, it doesn't say with a, right? It says just with great. So remember, with a yes. great caution about yes, so is. prices. Yeah, that is. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. I'm in sorry. Four, mm -hmm. In the number four, I don't know. Okay, it says many companies would rather operate as the as a premium, premium. option once they the product. Uh -huh. is in is in the decline ah, d d maybe the article d the this one in the decline stage mm -hmm. yeah. i maybe. check i check the answer my answers all right good good hey, uh, thank you so you let me know later all right you let me know mm -hmm. Okay, people. Well, uh, only with that one. You you had problem only with that one. Carlos, solo con esa tuvo problema. Only with that uh, one. Eh, sí, solo con esa dos. All right. Okay. All right. Thank Good. you. No problem. There we are. So, guys, today we are going to start by a, doing just a, a, a short review. And I want to take you to the would rather use stage because we want to do the exercises we haven't made before. So we haven't done a lot of exercises. So we want to see some exercises that you can do in, uh, in an online worksheet, all right? So I will give you the link. Everybody, please go to the chat and I will send a link for you. And let's go to do that. Let's do it together just as a manner of um, review, okay? Oh, where it is. Ah, I was this way. Okay, let's start by the first a link. This is just a manner of review because you have to formulate some uh, sentences to present your analysis. Remember that you have to present today your analysis and you will need some structures to present these analysis. And one of these uh, um, structures, grammar structures that we have studied are these with would rather, right? We said would prefer, would rather. It's up to you which one you are going to use. But remember, when you use would rather, it's like a conditional. And when you use would prefer is more something, well, actually it's a conditional, but you use a different structure. You use the infinitive and the infinitive is using two. So let's go to these 
uh, exercise. This is uh, an online worksheet. It's going to be easy. There you're going to get your, your grade right in the moment you finish. Okay. So I will send the link through this chat. Okay. There it is. Click on the link, please. And let's go to uh, solve this exercise. Okay, then it says, are you there yet? Are you all of you there? Easy, right? What do we use would rather for? Do you remember? When? When we uh, when can we use would rather? Any idea? Uh, when we use, um, I prefer something. Exactly. When you choose one option uh, and you discard the other option, maybe you are deciding between more than two options, but you are choosing only one, right? So you say would rather, you prefer that uh, option instead of the other option, okay? You like something more than the other thing they are offering to you. And you choose to get one of them, okay? So that it's when we express, the preferences, okay? We express our preferences using would rather or would prefer. Prefer is the real verb or the main verb that expresses the preferences that means prefer, right? But prefer is with one structure and would rather is um, kind of polite and also it's mm, kind of formal, but at the same time, it gives you the sense of um, the sense hmm, of not only formality, but in the sense of politeness, right? And at the same time, you are expressing this as a possibility. Maybe it's a possible future. It's not only for the present because would rather is not only for the present, but would prefer maybe or prefer works on the, only in the present and for futures, but for futures uh, as the present simple is used. But would rather is like a conditional because we use would in a possible future, right? And would, remember that would is the past tense of will. So we use would as the same as we use it in any other, um, in any other expression using would, okay? So let's go and check this exercise, okay? So let's go and read the instructions for the letter A part. By Los que acaban de entrar, Váyanse al link que está en el chat. Ahorita lo vamos a volver a compartir para los que no lo tenían. Ok. No sé por qué me tira una imagen. La imagen, hagan el caso omiso y váyanse al link. ¿Verdad? Please click on the link and go to the online worksheet. Then you are going to complete each sentence with, with, with would rather and the verb in parentheses. Remember that when we use would rather, we use the simple form of the verb, the first form of the verb, the first, first column in the list of verbs. We don't use to in this infinitive. So this is called the bare infinitive, okay? Bare infinitive is that infinitive that doesn't take two. So number one, it says, my father and the verb that I have to use is get up. Then the early don't sleep late. So get up early, then sleep late. Then, a ver, están todos ya ahí para que comencemos el ejercicio. Yes. 
Okay. No, no, teacher, me no. Alvaro, okay, go no. to the link here in the chat of Zoom. Click yes, on the link in, I sent. The second, in the second link or the, or the first link? Actually, it's the same one, but it's, I mean, it, In the same? Okay. Yeah, it's the same, but go to the Belong. link. Belong. Okay, I, I am, I'm am here. All right, click on the link, and then uh, it's going to take you to an online worksheet. Online worship. Online yes. worship. Mm -hmm. uh, make interactive worship. Exactly. Mm -hmm. uh, make, okay. Tutor, tutorial, video tutorial, or get started? Uh, no, go, scroll down. Scroll down. So, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Link, link to this worship. Uh, let's see worship. what brother. Would rather, yeah. Lesson C, it's the the uh, topic. Would rather, okay. Yes, would rather. Mm -hmm. so. Thank you. Okay. Bye. Okay, Bye. let's Bye. let's do it together, guys. So it no, says no, complete. No, 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 no. Wait a minute. Not yet. All right. Tell me, where are you? Uh, here. Aren't you uh, there yet? Okay. Yeah, and this in my. Uh, oh. I know it's asking you to join, but that's not the way. So um, I will send it through the WhatsApp group. All right. I will try. Uh, Just one second. What is the chat? Uh, chat, 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 chat here. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. There it is. I sent it through the WhatsApp group. Uh, I don't, I don't, I don't stay that. And uh, sorry? Lesson C, uh, lesson C will write it? Yes, that one. Ah, yes. Okay, mm -hmm. okay, I got it. Okay, people, so let's go and check this out. Let's look at the, um, the first part or the part A. It says complete the sentence using the correct form would rather end the correct form of the verb we are going to use to complete it, right? The action. Uh, to express a preference, right? To express a preference. So number one, are you there yet? Number one, who wants to say number one? Number one, my father mm -hmm. would, ra would rather get up. Mm -hmm. Early All and right. sleep late. Good. Number two, guys. Some people will uh, rather drive long distances than fly. Very good. Mm -hmm. Number three. Number three, Jenny would rather live or live. 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 Uh -huh, because we Live. don't have to conjugate, just Without the very S. infinitive. Yes, very infinitive. Okay, Jenny would rather live in a small town than a big city. Very good. Number four? Roland would rather see the action movie than the document. All right, and number five? Sylvia would rather mm -hmm. go to the beach than the mountains for vacation. Very good. Very good. So let's go to part B. It says answer each question with would rather, a pronoun and a verb, use a contraction of would. So we, we have to substitute they um, in the answer the first, right? Because it says answer each question with would rather a pronoun and a verb, okay? So let's go and check what will be the answer for the question number one. Would they rather go to Jackie's house or the mall? Contraction, they'd rather uh -huh, go 
go to Jackie's house. There you go. Mm -hmm. Number two, would he rather watch TV or see a dance performance? He'd rather uh, uh, watch TV. Actually, it says- Dance, dance performance. Uh, Okay, no, no, no. Look, it says, would he rather watch TV or see a dance performance? It says, he oh, yeah, rather. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He, oh, I see. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, he uh, rather uh, 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 see a dance performance. Very good. So yes, number three. I understand. All right. Number three, guys. Who wants to read the question? She rather. Uh-huh. That's rather... the answer. Okay, go ahead. Mm -hmm. She'd rather. Bowling because. Go. Go. Bowling. Go, go bowling because she it's rather, going to rain soon. All right. There you are. Thank you very much. Now let's go to part C. There we have to match the sentences, number, I mean, the numbers with the letters. So let's read. Jan would rather not get there for dinner. Let's match it with the correct next part. E, it's too expensive. It's too expensive, all right. Now let's look at number two. Let's see, no, let's see. No, 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 there, uh, no. No, forget it, forget it. Ok, Eso. va. Miren, me leen la, la oración eh, del número o digamos, por ejemplo, decimos number two, leen la oración y luego with letter tal y leen lo que falta, ok? Vamos. Number two. Number two. Uh -huh. Luis Burral, Nastari Creek. Uh -huh. With... D, he uh -huh. thinks it's too difficult. Okay, vamos a ver. He thinks it's too difficult. All no. right. Yeah, uh, no Don't you agree? No. Maybe B. B? I mean, it's young. It's young. Yeah, it's a, a one person. Yeah, it's he. Uh, yeah. He thinks it's too difficult. It's he. No, no, yeah. number two. Number two, Santiago. Ah, two. Ah, Luis. Mm -hmm. Would rather not study Greek. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he thinks it's too difficult. Right. Okay. Number three. Three would rather not, si not sit outside. Mm -hmm. With it, it's too wind. windy. It's too windy. All right. Number four. Number four, I'd rather not take the subway with C. Let's walk it instead. Let's walk. Let's walk instead. Okay. Number five. They would rather not walk today. They are really tired. They are really tired. They are really tired. It's B. Letter B. All right. Yes. yes. So now let's go to the part D. It says, complete the questions with would rather, the pronoun you, and a verb from, from the box. So you will have to start, for example, in number one. Have, I'm sorry, would you rather, and then the verb, a test on a computer or on paper? Okay, I could say take, right? Mm -hmm. uh, would you rather take a test on a computer or on a or on paper, right? Uh, but we have to write it down, okay? Would remember okay. to use the first, the I mean the cap, uh, the initial 
Capital initial, I'm sorry. I. Yeah, but, but first we we I we, won't, we, 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 we could I die. I would no. rather have a huh? test on the computer or on pencil. On no, paper. No. It's a it's a question. Yes, me. it is a question. Excuse yes. Me. Excuse me. No problem. Who? Uh huh. I. I rather. We have Hi. to use the pronoun you. So will you would you rather will you rather you. take a test? Yes. Take, yes. On a yes. computer or on a paper? Mm -hmm. Will you mm -hmm. rather mm -hmm. have mm -hmm. a test on the computer or on the paper. Okay, but we can use also the verb take, all right? When we are doing a test, we can use the verb take. Tomar un examen, right? Take a test. Take, take. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Clara, take is correct. Mm -hmm. Take. Will you, rate, will you rather take a test? Yes. On a computer or? On a paper. Or on paper, yes. On a paper. Mm -hmm. Okay. Did you finish? Uh, fueron a mi paso o todavía tienen que llenarlo? A ver. Si tienen que llenarlo, demos dos minutitos para que lo terminen de llenar. And the idea is that you okay. click on finish and Thank get you. your score. Okay. Get your score. And then you send it through the WhatsApp group because I want to see this as evidence that you worked, all right? Tell me. And the part B. Uh -huh. uh, ¿cómo, cómo que quedaban las, las respuestas? In the part B. Uh, the part B. It, uh -huh. it was about the answers. Okay, answer each question. We would rather a pronoun. Okay. Uh, you have to, I will show you. All right. I will show you. Would they rather you have to answer each question, right? Would they rather go to Jackie's house or to the mall? We have to answer with one of the options. So we have to say which one they, uh, which option they prefer. So they'd rather go to Jackie's house, right? And the same with the others. You have to look for the pronoun that sub substitutes the subject and then rather and then they okay. verb. Mm -hmm. okay. Complete Thank the you. sentence. All right. Excuse me, teacher. I didn't know Tell that uh, we need to we needed to write the sentence, but I I didn't know. But I, the last one I did, but the first I uh -huh. only participate, but I can uh, feel it. Uh, if you will let me. Yes, uh, please do. It. Yes, yeah. please Thank do you. it. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. I do it uh, quickly. Okay. Okay. No problem, Santiago. Go mm -hmm. ahead. Okay.
Be quiet, please. Be quiet. Silence. Teacher, are, are you speaking? I can't hear you. Calling the roll, oh my goodness. <laughs> Thank you. Y yo decía, ¿y por qué no encienden sus, sus cámaras? Va a decirles estaba. Okay, please everybody, turn your camera on and I'll call the roll meanwhile you are doing the online worksheet, all right? So please stay present when I call your names. Remember that today is Monday the 22nd and today we are starting the new unit. So please everybody be ready. Alvaro Ernesto Aguilar Peñate. Ana Lorena. Here I am, here I am. Okay, thank you. Ana Lorena Lobato Orellana. I saw her. Present maybe. teacher. Okay, there you are. Thank you. Boris Alexander Cortez Cáceres. Present teacher. Good. Carlos Alberto Dominguez Martinez. Present. Okay. Carlos Ernesto Hernández Cepeda. Present teacher. Okay. Edwin Antonio Quintero Sumaña. Present teacher. Good. Elias Neftalí Martinez González. Present teacher. There you are. Eulice Torres Torres. Present. Fatima Noemi Umaña Castro. Miss Fatima, are you there? Oh, she's just a listener too. Jose Miguel Torres Hernandez. Present teacher. Good. Jose Salvador Bernal Quintanilla. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Welcome, Jose Salvador. And I don't remember. Oh, yes, you were here on, on Friday, right? Okay, Josman Atilio Serrano. Present teacher. All right. Karen Lisette Sanchez Castro. Present teacher. Okay. Kevin Alfredo Lucero Mendez. Menendez. Present. Present. Okay. Ah, you weren't on Friday, right? You didn't come. Excuse me. <laughs> uh, okay, well. Nelson Alberto Per. It was Friday, Kevin. Ha uh ha. -huh. <laughs> Nelson Alberto Peraza Mejia. Here. There you are. Yeah, so um, this is a very loyal student. He's always here and I appreciate that, Nelson. Yeah, congratulations and thank you very much. Rafael Alexander Serna Diaz. Point. <laughs> Present teacher. Okay, yeah, thank you. Vamos a hacer como que estaba en, en mute, Nelson, no hay mucho por ahí, como que quito. Point, de... extra point. <laughs> yeah, he's jumping, he's jumping, hoping. <laughs> Santiago Roberto Calderón Avelar. I would rather. Oh, okay. Wilber Alberto Pérez Méndez. Presente, Okay, we, but we miss you. You haven't been in the last classes. Well, you were here as a listener, right? But when Sorry, you, teacher. You uh, I've had, I've had a, a lot of work. Oh, and okay. currently I'm here for miracle because oh, uh, we are busy. Oh, okay. All right. All right. I, I understand. I understand. Don't worry. If we can support you and anything to catch up, here we are. All right. Count on me too. Okay, people. So let's continue with this and send me the screenshot of your score, okay? Through the WhatsApp group. A ver, mándenme entonces su score. Ahí por el WhatsApp. Don. 
Uh-huh. Uh, where am I? Discord, where is Discord? Is over there. What do you want to do? Teacher, just, just a screenshot. Yes. Or... Yes, only the score. Hombre, muchas que no puedo superar que me dio tanta risa. Me, me está, habla, está hablando, teacher. Así que yo, oh, God. Yo ya estaba en la mitad de la lista y decía que nadie, todos están bien concentraditos en el ejercicio. Dije yo, ay, no me pasa, no me pasa. No, hombre. I think uh, I have... Uh, uh... Some uh -huh. wrong because I didn't have this uh, apostrophe, eh, sino que le puse doble, eh, porque no tengo aquí como, no sé dónde ponerle el de they the rather go or he the rather dance. And yeah. uh, I, I put it topple. Eh, oh, okay. Eh, what's the name? The topple. Oh, eh, yeah, 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 yeah. The cool. Aha. Uh -huh. The cool. But uh, I don't know where the, this. Uh, where are the are you are you from a computer or are you in computer uh, computer uh, okay it's computer. Uh, you have to know. check but you i don't to... care i oh, okay. i got it eight to ten it's okay all right i don't good. need to have ten but i have <laughs> i know i have ten but uh, that's yeah. the problem okay, okay. Um, um, we send it uh, right now uh, in the group yes please in the whatsapp group just as a manner of evidence oh i see okay. mm -hmm. There you are, guys. Nice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm I, I, I send you the the my run. Okay, mm -hmm. I send that. Okay. Elias, um, what what happened there? Tell me. Uh, I mean, would and this is my problem. Take I will it see. Is... Sorry, teacher. I forgot uh -huh. to, to write the problem. Sorry, sorry. Uh huh. What, what what happened? I I'm seeing that you. Well, actually, what I'm seeing is that they seem okay. Would rather take. Got it. And the other one was. Ah, watch instead of C. Okay. Yeah. All right. Good. But now you, you know that it was C because it was the, the next option. Okay, good. Yes, teacher. Good. Very good, Kevin. Good job. There you are. Good Boris. And what went wrong here? What went wrong? I can't see what went wrong. Mm -hmm. Roberto, it says, Hit brother, hit brother. Oh, it's the same thing, uh, um, Roberto. Carlos yeah. Roberto. Uh, a ver, Roberto, Roberto. Ah, yeah. It's because, yeah, Mr. Roberto Calderón y Santiago, right? Yeah, okay. yeah, right. Okay. Yeah, it's because of the cools. Yeah, mm -hmm. because. And let's look at the other ones. Say, would you rather? Mm -hmm. Is there any question so far? Are we okay? Okay. Hello. Uh huh. Yes. Hello, Alvaro. Tell me. <laughs> Sorry. Tell me what. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No. 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 I thought you had a question because I asked. Do you have any question so far about the? Uh, no. 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 It's okay. Uh, okay. No problem. <laughs> 
because you said hello at the same time. So I thought you were going to answer. Okay. okay. Today we came so crisscross, right? <laughs> All right, people. So now we are going to practice just a little bit with the quantifiers. This is a way to um, identify the use of the quantifiers. Remember that the quantifiers are uh, defined or they define, acti uh, I'm sorry, quantities, amounts. And we have to be aware if we are using a countable noun or a non-countable noun. Remember, a few and a little with small quantities, right? Many, much, um, indefinite quantities, but big amounts. Many with countables, much with uncountables. Um, let's see which one, uh, which other, I'm sorry, which other, which other, which other. So I will send you the link right now and let's go to do this online worksheet just as a manner of feedback too. And to, um, to practice the use of quantifiers. Here. For some reason, when I send the link, it shows uh, an image. It shows an image. No le hagan caso a la imagen, go to the link. All right? Okay. It's Oxford University Press. You need yes. three exercise one. Some, any, much, many, a lot of, a little, a few. Exactly. Is that correct? Okay. Yes. Okay. We can begin you, to do it. Yes, please. You may start. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I start. Mm What number are you doing at this moment? Number one. <laughs> all right, all right. Yeah, you have a, a menu, okay? It displays mm -hmm. a menu, so click on the yeah. little arrow. Right. And it's going to show you the options. There is only two options there, so. Right. Mm -hmm. Ok, vamos a ver. Yo creo que van como por las cinco ahorita, vea. You're right. Got it? All right. So, number one. Number, who, who's got number one already? Yeah, I, there aren't many car parks in the center of Oxford. Yes, it's many because we can count the car we parks. We can count, right. Yes, but not always. Not always because if you say parking, Parking, just a space. It, it could be car yes. park and car both. parks. Right? Yeah, both. Right. You're right. Yeah. Eating yeah, yeah. out is expensive here. Number two, right? And who has the answer for number two? Some. Eating, eating out, is, uh, eating uh -huh. out is expensive here. There are some cheap restaurants. Some cheap okay. restaurant, no. Okay. I put any. Any, any. Okay. I think it's any. Let's say why. Because with negative sentences, right. we use it's any. Any, any. Mm -hmm. right. With positive, we use some. Some. And okay. with negative, we use any because we cannot uh, 
write some with a negative, all right? Any cheap restaurants. Number three, who's got the answer? Who's got the answer? Liverpool has a lot of great nightclubs. All right, it's countable, right? right? It's Count. correct. Mm -hmm. Number four. Do you have number four yet? Hurry up. We only have a little time before the coach leaves. Very good, coach. Mm -hmm. Great. Number five. A, a few. It was a view, huh? A view. I know because time is uncountable and we use a little with uncountable, a few with countable. A few, or oh, that is uncountable. No, a time few is, is with countable. Mm -hmm. yeah. No, time is non count, non count. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you have to use a little, a little time. Uncountable. Mm -hmm. Okay. I thought because you can say eight o'clock, nine o'clock. Okay, but it's no, that's different. Yeah. That's different because you can, <laughs> yeah, because you can count yeah. the hours, right? You can count yeah, the, the hours, hour. but you can count the time. Yeah, yeah but the time is uncountable. You're right. Okay. Okay. So, number five. We saw, we saw some beautiful scenery when we went to Austria. Austria, all right. Mm -hmm. Because it's Some, positive, right? It's affirmative, yes, correct. Yeah. Number six. There are a few shops near the university. Very good. Uh, and yeah, this is shops. in an yeah. affirmative, I mean, in a positive sense, uh, right? A few. A few. Sure. Mm -hmm. Number seven. It's very cute. It's very cute. Quite. 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 It's very no, no. quiet. It's very quiet. There aren't many people here today. Okay. Many. Okay. Many. many. Why? Because we can count people. It's countable. So we use many. And the pronunciation of the first many. sentences, it's very quiet. Because if we say quiet, we are saying a different um, a different word and quite just like a, a little, right? Or just a piece of something, a quiet, quiet, quiet. But if we say quiet, we say tranquilo, right? Quiet. Number eight. Excuse me, seven, it was uh, most people, huh? the number seven. Many. It's very quiet. Many. Ah, there are many people, right? Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. there it's, are many. it's negative. Yeah, yeah, it's negative. It's, it's negative. Many. It's negative, but here it doesn't anything to see the negative because or people, affirmative. People it's because is, of people we use many. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. There are some expensive new flats next to the river. Very good. Flat is another word to say apartment. Okay, it's another word to say apartment, and it's used in the British English more than in the uh, American English. So there are some expensive new flats next to the river. All right. So please go to the score, and it has to say eight of eight. Okay, that's your 10 points, all right? Please, the same thing. Uh, do this, uh, take the screenshot and send it through the WhatsApp, just eight as a eight. manner of evidence that you worked. Eight of eight, of eight. yes. Eight of eight. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Thank you, Wilbur. 
Thank you, Boris. Okay. Let's send this one I can see. Oh, Nelson. Did you check which ones were your mistakes? Yes. But now you got it. Yes. Or is there any question you've got? No, I got it. Okay. Thank you. Good. Okay, great. Uh, Richard, uh, uh -huh. this, this exercise sent to the WhatsApp group, mm -hmm. but I, I am not, I am not in WhatsApp group. Okay, you have to go to your um, email confirmation that you were enrolled to this course, and there you have your link to okay. join the WhatsApp group. Yes. Let mm -hmm. me see. Yes. Join through the link and then you can um, okay. send. But unirme al chat. All right. Good. Mm -hmm. Pero, but I. But the, mm -hmm. the problem is the load, the Dolan again. Again, the. And the app and mm -hmm. I and I did and and I did I, I don't I don't remember I I did the download the app. Oh you oh, haven't okay. downloaded it. Don't yes. you have don't you have what's ah in your computer? Yes. Okay, but you can open it up, I mean through the browser. If you don't want to uh, download it and install it in your computer, you can just go through the um, um, through the browser. Go to Google and open WhatsApp in the Google uh, in the Google app, and then you can do what you want to do of joining. Uh -oh. All right, people. Um, you can do it later, Alvaro, if you want. Okay, you can do it later of joining. All right. I, know, and I can. I can do. I can do. Not for the browser. No. Yeah. In the browser, uh, where what what's right in the in the in the browser? You have to uh, the the link? Uh, no. You have you have to link your device your where you have your WhatsApp with a computer to open WhatsApp in the computer. Yes, I am open my WhatsApp in the computer. Okay, then do it through the WhatsApp. Yes. Okay. And the blog said in the blog said WhatsApp. Uh huh. Um, okay, just give me one second. I will do a different thing as a manner of helping you here. See Alvaro, right? Uh, one second, Alvaro. Okay. All right. Uh, one moment. But it's the same thing you would need if you want to do it through the computer, then you have to download it if your computer doesn't accept it doing it through the browser, okay, because it will it won't be possible. It won't be possible unless you download the application. Right. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, I don't know if there is one thing here link a device link device. Settings, start messages, new group. Mm -mm. Oh, it's not going to let you do that.
¿Alguien, ha, ¿Alguien se ha unido al grupo sin bajarlo a la computadora, al WhatsApp, y que lo, hagas, lo haga desde el WhatsApp? A mí, desde la computadora. Sin bajar la aplicación. Yo, a ver, eh, ¿puede, ¿puede explicarnos un poco cómo hizo? Sí, solamente escribe en WhatsApp web. Uh -huh. en, en el navegador WhatsApp web. Abre un enlace con un QR y el uh -huh. QR lo lee desde WhatsApp de, del teléfono. Ya se mete en la aplicación del teléfono y, y se va ahí a los tres puntitos que están arriba y apunta a la pantalla para que le lea el, el QR y se enlaza, se enlaza la información del teléfono con la computadora. Ok, thank you. Vaya, Álvaro, esa es la manera normal de, de hacer el link de su teléfono y abrirlo en el browser. Pero, sí. Eh, lo, sí, mi... I, I did that. I did that. But, okay. uh, Pero usted lo que quiere es unirse. You want yes. to join. Yes. Puede unirse desde el teléfono, abra su email desde el teléfono, se une en el teléfono y después ya puede trabajar en el browser sin bajar la aplicación. Ah, pero ya si quiere bajar la aplicación, también lo puede hacer en la computadora. Ok. Uh -huh. Ok, people. The next activity we want to do is a reading, a uh, comprehension activity. And we want to uh, try the, uh, the speed of what we listen when someone else is reading for us. And then we want to practice our speed of reading aloud, okay? Reading aloud, like imitating what we are listening to. So we are going to listen first the audio, okay? And then I will show you the reading. And then we are going to practice reading and uh, the speed as I said. and. One of the thing is, things is that this is an excerpt of an article uh, related to the iPods, okay, iPods. This is the topic we are going to listen to right now. Remember that we were starting a decline stage. Remember the decline stage of a product. So this is related to the strategies to manage the decline stage of a product and also what is or what to do, not exactly as an strategy, but like provisional, okay? Something that you are just like smelling it's going to happen, okay? So we want to see what happened with Steve Jobs with the iPod, okay? So we're going to listen right now. Listen to this audio. Twelve years and twenty six devices later. The generation-defining iPod range looks like it's about to fade into history without so much as a whimper. I think all of us have known for some time that iPod is a declining business, said Apple boss Tim Cook in 2014, discussing the company's latest earnings report. He announced massive profits as ever, but noted that iPod sales had dipped 52% down on this time in 2013, with further drops expected. The iPod had been nervously looking down over its shoulder for some time. When the iPhone was launched in 2007, Steve Jobs joked that it was the best iPod we've ever made. And he was right. With its apps and other smartness, the iPhone meant there was no longer any need to own an iPod as a separate device, so long as you could afford it. Apple wasn't afraid to create a product that would disrupt a successful existing business. Apple thought, if we don't do something, someone else will. And even today, despite that dramatic 52% fall, the iPod range still generates big revenues, $973 million. But $973 million out of Apple's total revenues is just a minor sideline, or as technology news site The Verge put it, a hobby. 
which leads most people in the know to predict that while Apple may not discontinue the iPod in the very near future, we're unlikely to see any kind of significant update of the devices. Okay, people, words that you heard. Words. Palabras que sí comprendieron. <laughs> Technology. Uh, year, year. Technology. The year profit. The, the iPod was profit. Launched. All right. Million. Profits, mm. millions, the oh, year oh, what oh, when it yeah. was made or launched, launched. 2014, 2007. All right. Mm -hmm. When they began, the Apple begin, the iPad begin, yes. Okay. So we are going to listen to it again, and I just want you to see when they talk about the decline stage, okay, that they are talking about. All right. So pay attention, please. Twelve years and 26 devices later, the generation-defining iPod range looks like it's about to fade into history without so much as a whimper. I think all of us have known for some time that iPod is a declining business, said Apple boss Tim Cook in 2014, discussing the company's latest earnings report. He announced massive profits as ever, but noted that iPod sales had dipped 52% down on this time in 2013, with further drops expected. The iPad had been nervously looking down over its shoulder for some time. When the iPhone was launched in 2007, Steve Jobs joked that it was the best iPod we've ever made. And he was right. With its apps and other smartness, the iPhone meant there was no longer any need to own an iPod as a separate device, so long as you could afford it. Apple wasn't afraid to create a product that would disrupt a successful existing business. Apple thought, if we don't do something, someone else will. And even today, despite that dramatic 52% fall, the iPod range still generates big revenues, $973 million. But $973 million out of Apple's total revenues is just a minor sideline, or as technology news site The Verge put it, a hobby. Which leads most people in the know to predict that while Apple may not discontinue the iPod in the very near future, we're unlikely to see any kind of significant update of the devices. Okay, was it better now? Did you get more uh, yes. from this audio? Okay, what I, did you hear about the falling or the decline? I think the iPad uh, began to decline uh, 2014. Began, began. Yeah, began, mm -hmm. yeah. And the uh, 2000? 2000? 2000? 2000? 13. 13? 13 or 14? 13 because in uh, 13. 50, yeah, yeah, 13 because in 2014 they have 50%. Uh, 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 lost uh, of the market. Okay, the 52%, right? So yeah, it 50, was. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay, now we're going to read along. Okay, we're going to listen to the audio and at the same time, we're going to read the excerpt. Oh, very well. Thank, Thank you very much. All right. So now <laughs> just give me one second and I'll go there. This is on your page number 17 and your manuals, but I get, I mean, I got it in a slide, all right? So let's start off in listen, but read, all right? So here we go. Twelve years and 26 devices later, the generation-defining iPod range looks like it's about to fade into history without so much as a whimper. I think all of us have known for some time that iPod is a declining business, said Apple boss Tim Cook in 2014, discussing the company's latest earnings report. He announced massive profits as ever, 
but noted that iPod sales had dipped 52% down on this time in 2013, with further drops expected. The iPod had been nervously looking down over its shoulder for some time. When the iPhone was launched in 2007, Steve Jobs joked that it was the best iPod we've ever made. And he was right. With its apps and other smartness, the iPhone meant there was no longer any need to own an iPod as a separate device, so long as you could afford it. Apple wasn't afraid to create a product that would disrupt a successful existing business. Apple thought, if we don't do something, someone else will. And even today, despite that dramatic 52% fall, the iPod range still generates big revenues. $973 million. But $973 million out of Apple's total revenues is just a minor sideline, or as technology news site The Verge put it, a hobby. Which leads most people in the know to predict that while Apple may not discontinue the iPod in the very near future, we're unlikely to see any kind of significant update of the devices. Okay, here we go. Was it better now? Right. Okay. Much better. Fast. <laughs> okay, yeah, I know, I know. So let's see, the first... A um, paragraph, Carlos Ernesto, the second from I think uh, will be for Wilbur, then Alvaro, the third one until 40. Okay, then from Apple, it's for Elias. Okay, from here. And then the last one will be for, let's see, who wants to do the last one? Who wants to read the last one? Again, again, start. Uh, just allow me to get the last uh, volunteer. I know Nelson wants to volunteer. Okay, there you go. <laughs> so the last one will be for you, Nelson. All right, so you may start, Carlos, with the first one. Okay, 20 years and 26 device later, the generation defining iPod range looks like it's about fade into history without so much as a whimper. I think all of us have known some, for some time that iPod is declining business. Business okay. said Apple boss Tim Cook in 2014 discussing the company's latest in a report. He announced massive profits as ever, but not at that iPod sales have had dipped to a, a five fifty two percent fifty two percent down on this time in twenty fourteen with further drops expect. Me? The iPod had been nervously looking over his shoulder for some times. When the iPhone was launched in 2007, Steve Jobs joked that this was the best iPod we've ever made. That's all right. Continue and... to afford it. All right, go ahead, go ahead. Elias, where are you, where are you going? He, and he was right. With his, with his apps and other smartness, the iPhone mean there was no longer any need to own an iPod as a separate device, so long as you could afford it. Apple wasn't afraid to create a product that wouldn't disrupt a successful, successful excited business. Apple thought, if we don't do, if if we don't do something, someone else will. Okay, and even today, despite that dramatic a uh, fifty-two percent fall, the iPod French still generates big revenues, nine hundred nine hundred seventy-three million of dollar, but this amount out of iPod to total. Revenues is just a minor, minor, I, I don't know. Minor. Minor. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, minor sidling or sideline. 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 Thank you. Or as technology news site, the Birch put it, a hobby, which leads most people in the know to predict predict that while Apple, Apple, sorry, <laughs> Apple may not discontinue the Apple in the very near future, where we're unlikely to see any kind of significant update of the devices. Very good. Thank you very much. Is there any questions so far? about the vocabulary or pronunciation of any word? Okay. What is this line? Spare. Sorry. Again, again, I'm sorry. Wimper. Wimper. Wimper is like if you say, <laughs> or something like that, <laughs> like, oh, yeah, como un gemido, right? Something like that. Mm -hmm. And sideline? Sideline. Sideline side is, line. in este caso, es una actividad secundaria, right? Something that it's uh, not so important. You have the main business in a different product. It's not in the iPod, right? It's a minor sideline. I mean, the 973 million. Uh, was not so much. It was a minor sideline. Era una actividad secundaria. Thank you. Okay. Uh, launch. Ah, oh, launch. Oh. Re relaunched. Uh, once uh, here. Uh, was. Launched. Launched es fue lanzado. Exacto. Fue lanzado por primera vez al mercado. Launched. ¿Mm? En el segundo párrafo, with further drop, expect. With further. With further drops expected. Con caídas que ya se esperaban más adelante. Drops, drops. Thank you. Father drops. Expected. Ya las esperaban. Caídas que fueron más adelante de 2003. Father drops. Mm -hmm. Drop. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Father. Father drops. Mm -hmm. Father drops. Caídas futuras o más adelante, más eh, pro, eh, próximas, pero en el futuro, right? Uh -huh. Más adelante. Okay, if you have no more questions, we are going to see, for example, okay? We say, um, let's refine some pronunciation. Uh, it was earnings. Looks, look. Earnings. Er, earnings. Earning. Earnings. 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 Yes. Aunque aquí parezca que vamos a decir ear, pero no, es earnings. Ganancias, earnings. ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. La palabra anterior, teacher. Latest. Latest, latest earnings. Drops earnings. Report. Latest. Latest. Latest, latest, latest quiere decir el más reciente o el último latest. reporte de ganancias o de, sí, latest. de ganancias. Latest. Uh -huh. uh, the other was had dipped, had dipped, ha vendido, ¿verdad? O ha uh, eh, eh, obtenido, podríamos decir en este caso had dipped, okay. Eh, cayó hasta ese, pero porque así fueron sus ventas, okay. Had dipped, 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 uh -huh. dipped. 
Yeah. Deep. Este es como una T al final. Deep. 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 Uh -huh. And Deep. the other was, de lo que Deep. les escuché, era, separate your two. Uh, device? Meant. Device Meant. is correct device. Uh -huh. Device. Meant. Meant. Este es el pasado del verbo mean, significar, ¿verdad? O destinado. Sería meant. The iPhone meant there was no longer any need uh, to own an iPad Meant. as a separate device. Right? The iPhone. Meant. M meant. Significó. Significó. O estaba destinado. ¿verdad? Pasado de mean. And the other one. Disrupt. Disrupt. Mm -hmm. Disrupt. Disrupt Rata. es como romper, ¿verdad? O interrumpir. Disrupt. Ajá. De una manera um, que vaya a desbaratar algo, ¿verdad? Disrupt. Disrupt. Luego Disrupt. la otra era. Disrupt is something innovative. Yeah, but it says yes. would disrupt a successful existing yeah. Minute business. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. But this like break. When you break in, up, right? When you mm -hmm. break uh, or make something better. Yeah, but you break in the innovation, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Innovation. That's correct. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then yeah. despite, despite, despite. Mm -hmm. Aparte despite. de, ¿verdad? O dejando right. eso de lado, despite. Yeah. O a pesar de. También. Mm -hmm. sí. También. Mm -hmm. Despite. Yes. Mm, then we have uh, la otra que les oí. No. Ahí estamos. Re sí. Re re revenues. Revenues, ganancias Revenues. o el total ingresos. de los ingresos. In, exactamente, incomes. Incomes. Mm -hmm. Revenues. Yes. Re Revenues. 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 Exactly. Revenues is all the money that comes into the um into the company, right? Revenues. From all the sales, from all the debts you are. Um, getting back okay so that's it. Mm -hmm. revenues money income okay are we okay so far okay el ejercicio de okay only two of you vamos a ver el primero le vamos a dar play Y tiene que hacer el match exactamente igual a la misma velocidad que el audio. Así deben de leerlo, ¿ok? Vamos. A ver. ¿Un voluntario? ¿A volunteer? Me, teacher. All right, go ahead. So, I will play the audio, so stay alert. One, two, and... 12 years and 20 years 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 later, the generation is six device related the like generation defining the iPod range so looks like, like it's about to all of us have known for some time that iPod is a declining history without so much as a winter. I think a lot of us have known for some time Apple you know, is a decline in business. Say that Apple was no, the book in iPad sales had dipped 50% down. The team discussing the company in the latest earnings report. He announced massive profits as ever, but noted that iPhone sales had dipped. When the iPhone was launched in 2007, 52% down on the best iPod we've ever made. And he was right. With its absolute uh, iPhone meant there was a mutual drop expected. The iPod has been just looking it. over it. its Apple shoulder for some time. When the iPhone was launched, uh, launched in Apple thought, if we don't do something, someone else will. Steve Jobs joked and that even it today, was a despite that dramatic 2% fall, he was right with his app and other smarts. Nine hundred seventy-three million dollars. Nine hundred seventy-three 
So, sorry. <laughs> Very good job. Okay. Yeah. Okay. It finished. Yeah. It finished. So you were and someone will, right? Someone else will. Mm -hmm. Okay. Just one paragraph that you left behind. Okay. But the audio left you behind. But, uh, well, you did a very good job. You did a very, very good job. Wilbert, did you say you wanted to participate? Yes, I would rather. Okay. All right, there we go. One, two, and three. 12 years and 20 12 years and 25 years. The generation device level, the iPod generation device 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 down on Red shoulder for some time. When the iPhone was launched 50, in 2007, Steve Jobs was the down best iPod in 2013 with brothers drops right. except it's the iPod had their donors only looking over no extraordinary their problems sometimes as a separate device. When the iPhone well, was launched on 20 wasn't afraid it took seven, Steve Jobs disrupted successful existence that it was the Apple best thought, iPod if we don't do something someone else will ever made. And, and even today, right. despite that we dramatic app, uh, there was smart, the iPod range still generates the iPhone big meets, revenue, there was no longer any million dollars. But to, 973 on the million dollars out of Apple's device, device so is just a minor sideline. Apple was not afraid to create a product which would describe a successfully existing business. To predict Apple, throw, well, Apple may not discontinue the iPad if, in the if we don't do we're something, something that's any kind of significant update of the device. And even today, despite the dramatic, see, Maria. There you go. No, but you're doing a good job, Wilbur. Okay, okay. Look, it was only the same. I mean, yes. only one paragraph left, all right? One paragraph behind. So I think you were doing a very good job, guys. Someone else did raise your hand. Who was it? Who was it? ¿Quién fue el otro que sí levantó su mano? A ver, ¿levantó alguien la mano? Yes, there we go. Okay. Teacher, so, tell me. Can you hear me? Yes, I can. Uh, Se fue la luz, puede ser que me vaya a desconectar. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. Thank you for letting me know. Okay. No problem. 12 years and 26 devices later. The generation. Okay. Let's go, sir. I mean, let's start, <laughs> let's start over because I didn't count on three. So one, two, and three. 12 years and 20 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 years and down the over shoulder for some time. Shoulder for some time. The iPhone when was launched in 2007. Was launching Steve Jobs in joked that it was the best iPod we've ever made. The best iPod we've right. ever made. It's and he was right. The iPhone meant Apple, there was no longer any new tune and iPod other as a separate device. So no long as you could afford it. Apple wasn't afraid it to create a product that would disrupt a successful business. Apple thought, if we don't do something, someone else will. And even today, despite that dramatic 52% fall, the iPod range still generates big revenues. Even today, despite that dramatic but $973 million out of Apple's total range is just a minor sideline. Or as the news side, The Verge put it, Seventy-three three million but to predict that while Apple may not discontinue the iPad in the out of near Apple future, today, we're unlikely to see any kind of update of the device. Or as a device technology device. new site, the first point. <laughs> I hey. lost. Yeah, but you were over here, right? Uh, but here, right? Revenues. Yes. Revenues. Okay. All right. And you lost only two lines over here. So 
you're doing a good job. You are doing a good job. The most important part here is not exactly the speed, is that you understand what you are reading. You understand or you may uh, let people understand what you are saying. That's the point here, okay? That's the point. It's not only reading and reading and reading. No, reading, but understanding and being understandable. Okay, so congratulations, you did a very good job. Okay, I will send the audio and I will send also the reading, uh, but you have it, you have it. Oh, okay, Wilbur, it's okay. So now let's go to the manual and in the manual we have some um, comprehension questions about the reading. And it says, for example, it was number one, if I'm not wrong. Oh, it was not, it was not a comprehension thing in the reading. It was for you just to um, analyze what happened in the decline stage of iPod and what happened, what did the the Apple company to um, deal with the decline of this iPod product. So can someone give me an opinion based on one, what we read here? ¿Alguien puede dar alguna opinión de lo que se analiza con ese pedacito que leímos acerca de ¿Qué sucedió con esa etapa de, de, de que se vino abajo, verdad? Ese, ese producto y qué hizo la compañía. Um, well, I think that there are moments in the company that is necessary necessary take decision and sometimes we have to how do you say arriesgar risk take risk and that's what uh, steve jobs doing with apple Okay, and as I said in the excerpt that iPod at that moment became to a sideline um, part of the revenues of this company, they were not afraid of uh, putting the iPhone as their main product, right? And invest or a bet, okay, bet for the iPhone instead of the iPod. And meanwhile, they were working on um, doing a better product with the iPod. I think they updated and they came to the top of the market with the new technology, right? With the innovation. Uh, remember that we have to be um, as companies, we have to be in the balance of exploitation but exploration so we cannot just be on sale but we need to explore what are the real needs in the market for example in uh i put a got got behind yeah could, we could say that got behind but the iphone grow Right, the iPhone grow and took the place of this functionality of music, right? Of music and videos and the, uh, the things we used to do in, the, in an iPod. And then the iPhone took the place. So they had to innovate through the iPhone and put this in, the, in a better position in the market to continue at the top, right? At the top as they are used to. So yes, we, uh, as they said, they were not afraid because they had a car product in the market already. Uh, and it was the iPhone, right? It was the iPhone. It came to substitute just a little while. Meanwhile, this was getting innovated, right? Or with new technology, new, uh, new softwares, 
they were developing a new product, a complete new product and with new functions according to the needs of the new market or the new needs of the new market in this case, right? So they had to do this marketing, uh, marketing process. They had to innovate, they had to do the exploitation, but at the same time, they, they were in exploration, right? So they were in this balance. That's why they um, draw their success, right? They draw their success. This is what they are talking about. They are talking about that even though the decline stage of the iPod was right there in front of their eyes, their eyes they had something to go over the crisis, right? So. That's what I can tell you about this. So uh, there are, let's say, four, ex four strategies uh, that we can use to manage the crisis or the decline of a company or of a product. So let, let's remember as a matter of vocabulary, um, as a matter of vocabulary feedback. Be uh, one second. Because in our feedback, I just want you to remember the words, but at the same time, I need you to remember the definitions, but you are going to give me the definitions, um, at least for association, okay? And uh, we, were, we were mentioning, or we mentioned some of these strategies, okay? We could lower prices, it will be the first um, option, right? Lower prices. After lower prices, we will try to repackaging or to re reinvent our presentations of our products, the way we sell, the colors, the, um, the packaging, right? If it was in plastic, now it's going to be in, I don't know, another material, right? Maybe not in plastic, but, but um, over- Excuse me, I am- Paper. Uh, I have a problem with my uh, uh, computer or I am right now with my device. Okay, but welcome back. Yes. Welcome back. Okay. Because they, they have a- uh, what's the name? The uh, energy down. Uh, a power on, cut. A, a power? Cut. Cut. Okay. Uh huh. Yes, yeah. But, okay. but you're back now. Yes, I am back right. with my device, with uh, my cell phone. Ah, my phone okay. Is, yes. <laughs> All right, good. So we were talking about the strategies to manage the decline stage. And as these company Apple did, right? Lower prices, repackaging, but we can also do the discontinuation. They said that they were going to sell all the products in the market. They were just stop. I mean, they, they were going to stop the production. So they were, they were going to discontinuate these kind of iPods. They are not going to produce it anymore, but uh, they are going to innovate. That was the plan, right? That, that, that was the plan. So they applied innovation, innovation, and also co-branding. Co-branding because iPad is a brand of these Apple companies. So co-branding could be, yeah, could be that they did a co-branding there. Actually, they were already branding but it was a brand of apple right it was a brand of apple okay so is there any questions so far so just allow me to introduce the class and then we're going to the breakout rooms you are going to work on your analysis that you are working at okay and um we want to introduce the marketing. It's going to be our unit two topic, marketing. Marketing is very wide. It's not something that we can focus in only one thing. It has a mix of elements, 
But we are going to see the this marketing mix as a matter of vocabulary. This is not a marketing class. This is an English class. Okay, this is an English class. We we are just defining the words and understanding uh, the definitions, terms related to marketing. Okay, so we are going to see the marketing processes, strategies, and also uh, the marketing mix. Right. This is why our objectives in this unit will be identifying the main elements of the marketing mix of renowned national products or services. You are going to decide if you're going to analyze a product or a service with the marketing mix. Analyze the components of the product and price strategies of a famous national product or service. The other objective will be to recognize the components of the plays and promotion strategies of a famous national product or service. Also, this maybe it's going to be the end or the main purpose of studying all of this to design a basic marketing plan for a product or a service. Remember that the marketing plan includes these two elements, I'm seeing these four elements that we are going to define and we are going to decide between two things and it could be a product, it could be a service, right? Now, the objective for today is that you uh, will identify the main elements of the marketing mix of a renowned national product or service. The agenda was our feedback. Our feedback was going to include uh, would rather the quantifiers, the reading we did about the iPod and the decline stage, that vocabulary we started last week. And today we are going to start with the marketing mix vocabulary. Tomorrow we will continue with the same topic, the mix, uh, the mix the four elements. But the most important thing is that you are going to work in your homework assignment tonight. And it's almost 9.40, so we are going to go in 10 minutes to the breakout rooms. No, four 10 minutes to the breakout rooms. And we're going to work on this, okay? Tomorrow we are going to do this, right? Because this is the marketing mix we are going to study. Product, price, place and promotion, the four Ps, right? Product, price, place, and promotion. Each of these elements uh, take a place, a very important place in an analysis or in any marketing strategy you are going to implement in your company. What is marketing? That will be a homework for you. You are going to find out what's the definition of marketing in business, right? In business marketing so we're going to see the elements for product price and the plays and the promotion okay then we will be analyzing a product okay after uh targeting a market and then we're going to analyze the products like this one this will be tomorrow okay so now in this very moment we are going to the break of rooms and we will continue with our analysis of the product, um, the PLC, right? Product life cycle of a product that you decide. Okay, so let's go to the break of rooms and then I'm going to assign those uh, students that were not present on Friday, okay? A ver, los voy a enviar de esta manera. Voy a abrir los eh, grupos en este momento que ya, de los que ya están. Y luego voy a ir asignando a esos mismos tres grupos a los demás, ¿ok? Los que no estaban el viernes. So, ¿qué es lo que vamos a hacer? A ver, ¿alguien quiere recordar o explicar qué es lo que vamos a hacer en el break of rooms ahorita? Y de los... present presentation de PLC mm -hmm. of an existing product, right? A real yes. product. Okay, you, your analysis. So your conclusions of your analysis, uh, your results of your analysis. Okay, I will open the rooms. So you may go right now.
Only 10 minutes, guys, only 10 minutes. We will discuss the uh, this product life cycle. Uh, yes, the PLC for, presentation PLC we were first. working on Friday. Okay. Please join your rooms, guys. What problem? Maybe um, fruity, bubalu. Fruity is interesting, but uh, fruity uh, they they are still. Uh, of the mark of the mark of the market um i believe i believe so but it's a, it's a small it's, it's a, a small. little a little 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 bit that presence google it okay. mm, so um yeah um, fruity, it, fruity? It, it, it could be fruity it could be a a good example because digamos por ejemplo por ejemplo este para la segunda igual una historia o relacionada de que llevara la congruencia y que llevara lo que significa cada etapa no me acuerdo sí. quién era el otro que iba con nosotros entonces Edwin ah Edwin era uh -huh. Andale. Mhm. Mm eh, ghostish. Somebody wanna read? Maybe me. Ensure people's expectation match product promise. Increase in production and sell. Increase in profit. In no threat of competition. Yeah. And the majority stage. Is majority or is maturity? Um, sorry, maduro. It's maduro. Maturity stage. Yeah. Um, SARS touch two hundred thousand in nineteen ninety nine. Uh, repositioning of maruti products. And 40 million two wheeler owners target targeted. I don't know how do you say that. Entry of competitors such as General Motors, Ford, and Tata. And the decline stage. Rafael. Uh, sí? Teacher said that uh, the uh, theory. 
The stage is maturity. With maturity. Tea. Okay, uh -huh. okay. Sorry. And the last, uh, last uh, stage is the client stage. Uh, in this moment, uh, the car have a heavy competition from I-10 and Spark, a uh, drastic decrease in sales, just 33,000 units sold in 29 and, 20, and the years 29, 2010, and uh, withdrawal from 13 cities, include, including Oh, un poco de Spanglish. <risa> Entonces, y así de acuerdo a la etapa, pues colocaba los datos referentes eh, reales del producto. Vamos a corregir eso. Si lo vas a corregir en la primera diapositiva, también, también hay we present. Oh, sí. Ok. Ok. Horrores ortográficos. Uf. Se me corrige esto. Solution. Mm, I think. Solution? I think that can be. Good idea. Um, have a WhatsApp group. I don't know how do you think about that idea. Yeah, it's okay. Can you do it? Maturity in decline. Uh, yes. Pero... Creo que Miguel tenía la segunda. Pero no está disponible. Netwin tampoco está. Carlos, tú tenías la última. O la tercera. Eh, la última. Decline. No. Maturity. No. Ajá, maturity. La tercera. Ajá, ahí lo puse en el chat. Ah, no hiciste la diapo. Mm. I'll do that tomorrow. Yeah. It's okay. okay. Hi, teacher. Uh, we are finished that here. You're done. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, our product is it's fruity. Okay. Yeah, we 
uh, we are agree with the uh, with the product, but we don't have more. We must to distribute uh, the the stage and the group and the which person make a presentation. We'll do. Oh, so you are presenting tomorrow? No, we don't know. We don't have nothing. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, but, uh, what, yeah. How many times? Uh, how much time we 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 have? It was for Two today. Months. It was for today. The presentation only two <laughs> minutes. Yeah, we. I think okay. it was a misunderstood. For, for tomorrow. All so. right, you will be presenting tomorrow. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Thanks. Thank you, teacher. How many minutes, teacher? Only two minutes. Okay. Okay, perfect. Okay. Good. Uh, so let's I go will... back to the main room if you want. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, I think uh, uh, I can uh, make the mark introduction and I don't know who can make the other stage and uh, we can advance because we can uh, don't give nothing. Uh, 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 we can but on if so if, if uh, somebody wants to help me, uh, can I speak with me? Okay, perfect, perfect, Santiago. Uh, you can, you can uh, make uh, the other, I don't know. The other stage? Yeah, Elias, you can make the road stage. Oh. Okay, dear class, we are going to start right now with the presentations. Remember that only two minutes per, per presentation. So um, we're going to start with the group number three, okay? No, group number three, you are able to present right now. Group number three is um, made up by Ana Lorena, Boris, Kevin, Rafael. Okay, you may start now. You can share the screen. Okay, can you see my screen? I will share with you the the PCL of Maruti eighty thousands eighty hundred. 800, sorry. <laughs> um, this is the, the, the first car imported and sold in 1983. That's the cheapest car in the market. Um, it have a huge gap between demand and supply. And the company took two years to clear, to, sorry, to clear the resulting waiting list. And the growth stage uh, 
and sure people's expectations match product promise, and increase in production and sell, and increase in profits, and no threat of competition. Um, the stage, uh, the, the, Maruti, the Maruti stage, sell it to uh, two hundred million in nineteen ninety nine. Repositioning of the maturity products uh, for forty million to Wheeler Owens target and the other competitors competitors search a General Motors for and Tata. If you want, Boris, continue. The, the client stage, having competition from I-10 and Spark. Drastic decrease in salads, use three, 33, 338 units sold in the in 20, 09, and 2010. Withdraw from uh, 30 theories, including metros. metros. Okay, that's the, the eh, Maruti. PCL. PLC, Rafael. PLC. 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 Yes. yes, PLC. Mm -hmm. okay. Product life okay. cycle. Okay, yeah. Is, is there any question for this group, guys? Do you have any question about the content they presented? Do you have any question? No, no, teacher. No, the same. Um, okay, okay, good. It was a very good presentation, okay? It was a very good analysis. The thing is that when you present results, you should be, um, um, let's say, more creative in the words you use. Uh, you used uh, the simple present, right? You use the simple present instead of using the vocabulary in the class. Uh, actually, you explained correctly what this is about, what each stage is about. So yes, you did a very good analysis, but at the time of presenting the results, my feedback and my suggestion for you guys is that use the vocabulary from the class, okay? You try to use the vocabulary from the class. For example, instead of using the simple present, you should use uh, prefer, people preferred, or people would prefer, right? Something like that. Maybe uh, the market would rather, okay? And then you can use these vocabulary, the amounts, for example, some, many, any, these things were not used. And uh, I think you could use it. You could use it because you had a lot of numbers there, right? You had a lot of amounts. So yes, uh, but you did a very good job. You did a very good job and it was a very good presentation, very good analysis. Okay, people. A ver, todos poniéndole like, la calificación para este grupo. A ver, a ver cuántos like obtiene este grupo. Good. One, two, three. Okay, four, five. Mm -hmm. Okay. Through the reactions, you can... Uh, Okay, good, good, seven, eight, nine. All right, very nice. So tomorrow we'll have two presentations at the beginning of the class. So please be on time tomorrow to present your results of your analysis, okay? okay. Um, did you, excuse me, did you forget to take a list or? or no, no, right now, I'm going to do okay. it right now. Yes, okay. remember that you should, I mean, you must, 
uh, turn your cameras on, guys. And also, when I call your name, you have to say present. The date. What date is it today? Today is? Today is the uh, 22? 22? 22nd. May the 22nd. 22nd, right. Yes, it's Monday, 22nd right? of May. Okay, it will be May the 22nd. May the 22nd. Yes. Okay, Álvaro Ernesto Aguilar Peñate. Yes. Okay, good. Ana Lorena Lovato Orellana. Present, teacher. Boris Alexander Cortés Cáceres. Present, teacher. Carlos Alberto Domínguez Martínez. Present. Carlos Ernesto Hernández Cepeda. Present. Edwin Antonio Quintero Sumaña. Edwin got disconnected, yeah. Elías Neftalí Martínez González. Present, teacher. Eulice Torres Torres. Present. Fátima Noemí Umaña Castro. José Miguel Torres Hernández. Present teacher. José Salvador Bernal Quintanilla. He had two devices, but I think he had some trouble with the audio. Okay. Osman Atilio Serrano. No, Osman? Oh, there he is. There he is. Um, Karen Lisette Sanchez Castro. Kevin Alfredo Lucero Menendez. Present. Nelson Alberto Peraza Mejía. Present. Rafael Alexander Serna Díaz. Present. Santiago Roberto Calderona Velar. I'm here. Okay, Wilber Alberto Perez Mendez. Present. Okay, and the session one on one for tonight is uh, for Edwin. Uh, he got disconnected, guys. Is there anyone who wants to get his place? to stay in the session one-on-one? -on -one. No se escondan ustedes. Cabal, cuando digo, Sorry, ¿quién se quiere teacher. quedar? Todos apagan la máquina. <laughs> la I'm video. sleepy. All right, well. Okay, I think it's not a problem. Uh, today we don't have uh, homework, but you can work in advance in the platform. Remember that you have an activity that I posted for the weekend, and it was about the Kodak decline stage. It was a very interesting video, so you can go and practice listening about the story, the history of Kodak. And Kodak also, um, uh, how did they manage the decline stage and um, the change, right? The change from the field of cameras and uh, films to the uh, medicine, right? Or pharmaceuticals, pharmaceuticals field. Okay, so you may go and check that out. It's posted on the platform in that discussion label. All right. Okay, people, see you tomorrow. Please be on time for the presentations. Ready with the presentations. Bye bye. Have a very good night and a very good rest. Good night. Bye bye. Good night. Okay. Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. bye. 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 Okay. Teacher, una pregunta. Tell me, Salvador. Eh, se me apagó el teléfono y, y volví a conectarme, entonces no sé si pasó okay. listo. Yes, I checked you in right now, okay? Just one second. Thank you, Salvador, for letting me know. There you are. ¿Y a quién le toca hoy la...? Le tocaba a Edwin, pero si usted quiere quedarse, con todo gusto. Mm, está bien. Do you want to stay? All right. Yes. All right. Okay, you may stay then. Okay, here we are, Salvador. How can I assist you with? 
Permite un momentito. Diga. Okay. Do you have any question I can give you any support with? Mm, por el momento está bien. Me ha gustado mucho el, el que usted nos ponga a hacer ejercicios así. Ah, para okay. completar en, así en, en línea. En me línea. Parece muy, me parece muy, muy bueno para el aprendizaje. Oh, sí, se practica mucho, se practica. Y se dan diferentes casos que tal vez no los habíamos visualizado, ¿verdad? Y de repente, ¿y aquí cómo haríamos, verdad? Para decir esto, y hay que darle vuelta y pensarlo. Uh -huh. Hasta que uno lo deduce, ¿verdad? Hasta que uno lo deduce. Y eso es lo que pasa en la vida diaria, fíjese, porque a veces uno en el momento dice, contesta cualquier cosa o de cualquier manera, y después se queda pensando, lo hubiera dicho mejor así. Ah, esto es mejor, está correcto decirlo de esta otra manera. Entonces es bueno practicarlo antes de que nos toque esa situación, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Así sí. mero es. Uh -huh. Y hasta ahorita, eh, con los temas que hemos visto, ¿cómo se ha sentido? ¿Ya los había visto antes? Eh, del good, good Rather, solo un poquito. Uh -huh. En un módulo anterior, había visto uh -huh. un poquito. Ah, okay. Así que, eh, básicamente, allí solo ampliarlo el tema. Exacto. El tema. Muy bien. Bueno, con el Wood Runner ya sabemos que es el ver infinitive, ¿verdad? O sea, el que no lleva el to. Se llama ver por eso. Así como cuando uno dice descalzo, ¿verdad? Barefoot. O sea, sin zapato, ¿verdad? Sin uh -huh. esa cosa es ver infinitive, sin el to. Uh -huh. Y se tra traduce prefiero o preferiría. Bueno, vale. I prefer es yo prefiero. Okay? Uh -huh. I would prefer, yo preferiría. I would uh -huh. rather, también, yo preferiría, ¿ok? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yo quisiera mejor esto, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Exacto. Y también podría ser como yo, eh, sí, eh, iría, por ejemplo. Iría, pero con la preferencia. Iría o con go, ¿verdad? O si es uh -huh. con have, would rather have, le da el significado ya. Por ejemplo, tendría. Eh, si fuera con otro verbo, digamos, run, correría, ¿verdad? Esa terminación eh, se la da con el would rather. Exacto. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo mejorar en la lectura, Ticha? Porque ¿Ah? yo estuve tratando de hacer el audio que usted puso a la parte. Ajá, ajá, ajá. <ríe> no, yo me quedo bien atrás. De veras. ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo uno puede mejorar un poquito en lo que es la, así leer, pero... No palabra por palabra, sino un poquito más rápido. Ah, precisamente eso. Hay que agrupar ideas. Eh, mire, ni en español a veces no somos tan duchos para la lectura rápida, ¿verdad? También a veces en español tenemos esa dificultad, ¿verdad? Entonces, lo que mejor, el mejor tip que puedo decirle es que no se quede en el que no pudo decir siga mm, con lo demás mm, porque usted mm. ya sabe lo que está ahí lo está viendo mm -hmm. entonces no lo pudo decir siga con la otra porque en realidad ahí está siga 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 y si lo está diciendo verdad ahora mm -hmm. si lo está leyendo sí porque quiere decir que no lo ha comprendido pero si, si lo está diciendo entonces sígale 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 en velocidad verdad pero como les decía lo más importante no es la velocidad. Lo más importante es que lo comprenda. Uh -huh. Eso es lo más importante. Que entienda el mensaje de lo que ahí dice. Entonces, si no ha entendido, si lo dijo bien rápido y después le preguntan, ¿y qué decía eso? Eh, no lo sé. Pude decir todas las uh -huh. palabras, pero a saber qué dice. Entonces, tiene que haber un balance ahí. Eh, si es bueno practicar la velocidad después que ya ha comprendido la lectura. Entonces, así como mm, hago, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Que primero les, se los pongo en audio, lo escuchan, se familiarizan, ven palabras, luego ven ideas. Ya cuando yo comprendo lo que dice ahí, vámosle. Ya, ya sé mm -hmm. qué dice, entonces yo voy con la velocidad. Es la manera, es la manera en la que puede practicar la velocidad. Pero como le vuelvo a repetir, lo importante es que lo haya comprendido. Mm 
ya de ahí practiquen, uh -huh. practiquen, practiquen decir al abrir la boca, no detenerse, uh -huh. darle directo hasta el siguiente, a la siguiente puntuación. Si quieren lo hacemos ahorita para que lo, lo pueda hacer, sí, pues no tenga pena, si para eso estamos por practicar. Esa es la idea de esta clase. Va, lo vamos a leer sin audio primero, ¿sí? We are going to read it together. Uh -huh. Ok, vamos a leerlo juntos, los dos al mismo tiempo, si gusta. ¿Sí? Mm -hmm. ¿Qué le parece? Muy bien. Bye. Hasta el momento ha comprendido todo lo que dice ahí, ¿verdad? Mm, buena parte, no todo, quizás no los detalles. Ah, o sea, digamos, palabras han quedado por ahí, pero la idea sí la, la ha comprendido. Mm -hmm. Sí, va, entonces, leámoslo despacio primero juntos. Y después usted arranca leyendo usted solito, ¿sí? Va, uh -huh. leámoslo todito juntos. Vamos. 12, 12 years, years and 26 and devices later. 20, 26 devices later. The generation defining the, iPod range. The generation defining iPod range. Looks like it's about to fade into history without so much as a whimper. Es lo que le digo, que hay que llegar hasta el punto, ¿verdad? Con el mismo uh -huh. aire desde aquí hasta aquí. Para no uh -huh. detenerse, ¿verdad? Porque ya entendemos lo que dice. Entonces, póngale que de aquí, the, the, the generation defining iPod range looks like it's about to fade into history without so much as a whimper. A ver, dele usted. Uh -huh. The generation defining iPod range look like it is about to fade into history without so much as whimper. Salvador, you see, you can do it. Very good job. Ahora, lo mismo, de aquí donde empezamos hasta cerrar sería el primer aire, ¿verdad? Entonces, mm -hmm. vamos. I think all of us have known for some time that iPod is a declining business. Stop. Okay. Mm -hmm. I I think all I think all I think all all of how no known. se detenga en lo que no lo no pudo decir usted siga okay uh, ahí uh, viene el detallito y después lo va a ir en tres veces que lo lea ya no se va a detener pero ahorita dele aunque se devane aunque se le traben alguna usted siga la que la que va en el ritmo mm. vamos I think of all of how, how now for some time that Apple is a declining business. Exactly. Ahora de aquí hasta el próximo que sería 2014. Ese es said o say. Said. Said Apple said. bus, Apple bus, Tim Cook in 2014. Oh, no, en este caso decimos 2014, okay? Set up a bus team cook in 2014. Mm -hmm. A ver, dígalo de aquí hasta 14. Set up a bu bus team cook in 2014. Exactly. Bye. Tenemos que llegar hasta acá, ¿verdad? Discussing the company's latest earnings report. Discuss discussing the company's latest earnings report. Yes. Ahora vamos hasta el próximo punto. Estaría por aquí, pero todavía la idea continúa hasta aquí. Entonces sería, he announced massive profits as ever, but noted that iPod sales had dipped 52% down on this time in 2013. Mm -hmm. Deli He announced it. Massive profit as ever, but not that Apple sales had dipped. Eso no sé cómo le. 52%. Fic, fic, 52% down on this time in 2015. Mm -hmm. With further drops expected. With further with, drops expected. With further, with Father drop expected. Correct. Vaya. Cree que de aquí se va usted solo llegando de ese, el inicio hasta el siguiente punto. Luego otra vez inicio a la siguiente que sería coma y así. Mm -hmm. 
con un solo aire llega hasta aquí, con un solo aire vuelve a respirar y llega hasta aquí, hasta aquí. Dele pues. Mm -hmm. ¿Cree que podemos? Sí, claro. Dele. Lo intentaré. Dele. The iPod had been nervously looking over his shoulder for some time. When the iPhone was launched in 2007, Steve Jobs joke, joke that it is what the best iPod will, will ever made. And he was right with its apps and other sm smartness. The iPhone meant and there was no longer any need to own an, an iPod as a separate device so long as you could afford it. Huh? Apple wasn't afraid to cre create a product that would disrupt a successful, exciting business. Apple, though, Draw if ah, we don't. ¿Cómo? Este es el pasado de think. Entonces sería Apple thought. Pensó. Thought. 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 ¿Cómo se escribiría? Así como está acá. Mire, aquí. Thought. Este. Thought. Este no se thought. pronuncia. Va directo a la T. Thought. Thought. Th Thought. Yes. Thought. Mm -hmm. Thought. If we don't do something, someone else will. And even today, despite that dramatic 52% fold, the iPod range is still generates bit re renewables. Revenues. Revenues. Estas cantidades, no puedo leer cantidad. ¿Cómo Bye, leer? Aquí van con los cientos, ¿verdad? 900. Diga 900 sería el 9. Mm -hmm. Luego 900. tenemos que decir el 7 que sería 70, ¿verdad? La decena. 70. 70 y luego la unidad. Las unidades son, en este caso, 3. 973. Million. Esta M significa million. Y tenemos Millions. que decir el tipo de moneda. Entonces sería así, mire, Salvador. 973 million dollars. A ver, dígamelo usted. 973 million dollars. Very good. Mm -hmm. But. But. Mm, 973. Three million dollars out of apples that re renews revenues. Revenues is just a minor side sideline mm -hmm. or technology news site that birds put it a hobby, which led Please. most people. Which leads most people in the now to predict that while Apple may not discontinue the app, the Apple in the very in in the very near future. Future. We're future. We're unlikely. Unlikely to see any kind of significant update of the devices. Very good, very good. La idea es llegar al siguiente punto, ¿verdad? O al, mm -hmm. a la siguiente coma en un solo aire. Así mm -hmm. usted va a ir mejorando la velocidad y también la entonación, ¿verdad? Porque como va de punto a punto, va a saber que es una idea completa y va a tener mm -hmm. su, su principio y su final, ¿verdad? Ahora también le va a servir llegar a la puntuación para darle sentido a la lectura, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Con sentido. Uh -huh. Porque incluso en español, cuando usted hace así, ¿verdad? Va de punto a punto y si lleva interrogación, lo lee como pregunta. Igual acá, ¿verdad? es exactamente igual. Y con mm -hmm. las cantidades, sí veo que le está costando un su poquito. 
Hay sí. que regresar un poquito a las cantidades, ¿verdad? Va, para los cientos, siempre le va a poner hundred a cualquier número que sea. Por ejemplo, one hundred, two hundred, three hundred, four hundred. ¿Verdad? Que sería el uh -huh. tercer número, ¿verdad? Para atrás. El tercer uh -huh. número para atrás son los hundreds. Uh -huh. Ahora, el segundo número sería las decenas, que sería ya sea 70 o serían 13 o 14, 19, lo que sea si fuera un 1, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. eh, si fuera un 2, 20 y luego el número de la unidad, ¿verdad? 21, 20, I mean 31, o qué sé yo, 41, hasta llegar al 7, 9, lo que sea. Estamos uh -huh. hablando de decenas, ¿verdad? El segundo número para atrás. Ahora, el último número son las unidades, y ese ya se dice normal como lo sabemos del 1 al 9, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. eh, el último. Pero del, el tercero acá sería hundreds. Cualquier uh -huh. número que mire acá, Sería, por ejemplo, pongámosle algunos ejemplos aquí para que lo practiques. Sería, por ejemplo. Vaya, si vamos a los. Vaya, le vamos a poner aquí. Le vamos a poner 150. Mire, como no hay unidades, digo completo uh -huh. la decena, ¿verdad? Va, ahora le vamos a poner este número. 876. Very good, very good. Ahora le vamos a poner este otro. Le vamos a poner... 780. Yes, correct. Now, le vamos a poner este. 456. Exactly. Entonces, ya para leer los años del 2000 al 2010, tenemos que leerlo completo. Mira, tendría mm -hmm. que ser 2000. 2001, 2002, 2003, 2004, 2005, 2006, entero, ¿verdad? 2007, 2008, 2009, and 2010. De ahí podríamos decir 2013, 2014, pero para practicarlo lo vamos a decir. A ver, ¿cómo sería así si lo dijéramos como ya lleva un número más, ¿verdad? Aquí solo eran uh -huh. tres números. Uh -huh. Aquí ya llevamos cuatro números. El cuarto número para atrás sería miles. Y el mil se dice thousand. Entonces thousand. sería two thousand, porque como no hay nada aquí, ¿verdad? Two thousand and fourteen. Fourteen. Yeah. Ajá. Si dijéramos este, el actual, current year. 2023. Very good. Ahora le vamos a poner cualquier otro número que no es un año. Vale, le vamos a poner para hacer los miles. Así. Seven thousand. Ajá. Ahora el nine. Nine. Aquí sería el hundred. Acuérdese que los tres números ah, son hundred, ¿verdad? Entonces sería nine hundred. Nine hundred. Y este sería el que dijimos acá, eighty. Eighty. Entonces sería seven thousand nine hundred and eighty. And eighty. Ajá. Podemos decir end o no importa si no decimos end, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Porque a veces usted ha oído que se dice end, pero uh -huh. end se usa, por ejemplo, cuando tal vez sería como eh, los centavos, ¿verdad? Los centavos en un número de dólares. Por ejemplo, si yo digo aquí, 973 and 50 cents, ¿verdad? Ahí puedo uh -huh. decir end. Y no hay problema si aquí no lo digo end. Y si lo digo, tampoco hay problema. Entonces podemos decir 7,000 
980. Vaya, vamos uh -huh. a probar este otro. Va. 7,000. Uh -huh. 800. 90. Uh -huh. Six. Very good, Salvador. Yes, that's correct. Entonces, ahorita puede ir uh -huh. practicando hasta los miles usted para irse volviendo a familiarizar. A veces uh -huh. esto se olvida porque casi nunca tenemos que leer cantidades. ¿Verdad? Pero, eh, porque no estamos en esa área, ¿verdad? De números. Pero sí es importante, es importante, ¿verdad? Más aquí en marketing es sumamente importante saber cuánto vendimos, cuánto no vendimos, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Cuánto no recibimos. Entonces sí vamos a estar leyendo algunas cantidades. Ahí usted se fija, el cuarto número, si son cuatro números, el primero tiene que decir thousand. El uh -huh. segundo de allá para acá, o sea, digamos del 7 para allá, ¿verdad? Sería de izquierda a derecha. De izquierda a derecha, el segundo sería el 100. De uh -huh. ahí el, los decenas o los tens. Y luego sería las units, ¿verdad? Las uh -huh. unidades. Entonces, así ya se va a ir ubicando usted, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Muy bien. Bien. ¿Estamos bien ahí? Sí, solo, solo quiero decirle algo. Sí, dígame. Eh, que quiero agradecerle a usted por, por todo su tiempo y todo el empeño que, que en, cada, en cada clase pone para enseñarnos. La, la vez pasada, en el curso anterior, este, yo me iba a retirar, ya no iba a seguir con el curso de inglés, porque este, la, la verdad es de que no, siento yo que no, no, avanz, no había avanzado mucho y entonces... Me, me había desanimado, pero usted dijo que, que continuáramos porque si no íbamos a atrasar a los otros compañeros. Y yo dije, bueno, por, por si yo me retiro, voy a hacer causa de que otros se atrasen. Dije yo, no es justo. Entonces, Ajá. aunque sea de complemento aquí de pelota, voy a irme yo también. Así que por esa razón he continuado y le agradezco a usted porque la verdad es que estoy entendiendo mucho más. Quizás no participo mucho porque estoy un poco inseguro y, y, y por eso no lo hago casi, pero fíjese que incluso estoy leyendo un libro que está en inglés, no lo entiendo todo, pero entiendo la, las ideas generales de, del libro y le agradezco porque eh, lo que usted nos está compartiendo está funcionando. Qué bueno, me alegra escuchar esas palabras, Salvador, y mire, es importantísimo realmente, y qué bueno que se quedó por esa razón, pero también yo le quiero animar porque desde... El tiempo en que comenzamos, al tiempo en que estamos ahorita, yo he visto también su empeño, ¿verdad? Y su dedicación, y he visto su mejoría. He visto su mejoría. Eh, como tres veces quizás se ha quedado, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. En la, en la um, sesión uno a uno. Y en cada sesión ha habido un avance. Yo de veras también estoy bastante, eh, eh, digamos, mi objetivo Estoy bastante motivada porque veo el avance, ¿verdad? Mm. Y que me alegra, y que me alegra de veras que se haya quedado. No vaya a renunciar, oye, no vaya sí. a renunciar. Siempre entre y lo que no comprenda, díganos. Eh, si usted quiere por el WhatsApp, ¿verdad? Ahí ponga la pregunta, cualquier compañero le va a contestar o mm -hmm. yo. ¿Verdad? O yo le contesto en el momento o más tardecito, pero siempre le voy a contestar, ¿verdad? Y cualquier cosa, pues estamos a la orden para servirle, ¿ok? Much Muchísimas gracias, Ticha, le agradezco por su tiempo. Con mucho gusto, Salvador. Bueno, entonces nos quedamos ahí. Les voy a pasar sí. por el, por el eh, chat, les voy a pasar el audio y la lectura para que usted siga practicando la velocidad. ¿Verdad? Perfecto, Tisha. Ok, Salvador, have a very good night and see you tomorrow. Adiós, right. adiós, Tisha. Ok, take care, bye bye.